Yo, what is up, my fucking dudes? It's time for another legit food review. This time we're talking about... Fuck, I can't even say the name of animals. Because I'm Americanos. <laughs> <laughs> no, but what is up, guys? Uh, I'm going to be talking about Ori Monogatari. And why I love this anime to a fucking T. God damn, do I love this anime. Because you know what it does best for me? That I think a lot of other romance animes don't do best? And that's the fucking romance. Because it's very simplistic. The romance is very simple. It's not, it's not having to have all these overarching sub-stories or any of this shit like that. It's just a plain, simple, good old-fashioned, wholesome fucking love anime. The only time that there's ever, like, a real actual problem in a relationship is because they don't communicate. And that's what a good fucking... That's a good thing. Because guess what? It doesn't need no fucking outside bullshit. <laughs> I'm fucking kidding. Mind you, this is me talking after, like, finishing the series immediately. I fucking love this series, I'll be honest. Because, again, I'll reiterate what I just said a minute ago in my fucking stupid-ass voice. I actually like the show based on its simple premise of just being a simple romance anime. It's a very simple romance comedy to me. And that's it. It fucking does romance better than a lot of romance animes. And to me, like, I can't get into a lot of romance animes because it's usually either like, Oh my god, I love this dude, he's so fucking hot. Oh my god, we're in love, we're falling in love, fuck me the ass Naruto. You know, it's not a thing like that to me. And a lot of romance animes are like that. Or either a romance anime will have another, like, portion of a story. Or, like, have not a portion of a story. It would have another, like, section to a story that it doesn't fucking need. Say, like, a harem. Because then it just becomes a harem. Or a comedy. What this show does, in comparison to those, is it's just a very simple... Here's these two characters that factually... that that Yes, that factually love each other. They have facts about them that they love each other. <laughs> <laughs> but that's it. That's all it is. It's nothing more and it's nothing less. That's what I like about this. It's a very simplistic love anime. That doesn't rely on, oh, our main character is super duper fucking hot. And that's it. Or he has a tragic backstory or some kind of bullshit where you have to actually kind of like the character. That <laughs> I feel some stories will do. What this one does, it's just, these two characters are dating. Boom. Good. And I fucking love the, the way that they do the story and the way that they do everything with this goddamn show. Like, it's been a long time since I've actually enjoyed a romance anime that was just straight up just a romance. Nothing more and nothing less. Just a simplistic romance anime. And literally, for... What was it? For, I think, around... 14 or 15... No, not even that. For, like, 20 episodes. It legitimately is just our main characters actually reciprocating love. They're, they're actually caring about each other. You know, there's actual care to them. And that they're actually learning about each other. And stuff like that. It's just that. It's just that. And that's what's so great about it. It's just that. It feels natural. It actually feels like these two characters are just, you know, very lovey-dovey and very show, very affectionate with each other. And that's what's so good about the show. I, I can't put it... I can't even put it into words how much I fucking love the show right now. But, you know, the, it's a very simplistic. You know, it's a very good romance anime. That's it. I would actually recommend watching Odo... What is it? Ore Monogatari. There we go. I'm sorry, I'm not good with Japanese. But yeah, like, I would really recommend this show to anyone who, who wants just a very simplistic love anime. A very simplistic romance anime. That's just about the romance portion about it. 
it's got good comedy in it too, you know. It's got good, it's got good moments, but it's mainly a romance anime. And just to let you know, that's what it is. God, I fucking love the show. Kind of like how much I love about. Yeah. <laughs> no, but yeah, because it, it's it's one of those animes that I haven't really felt like. There's a good romance out there. Or there's like a good romance anime that's just a very plain, simple romance. I might be wrong, but that's because I don't watch a lot of anime anymore. But goddamn, do I love this fucking show. What are your recommendations for anime? I would actually like to know, because I'm, I'm in the mood to watch some good animes right now, and I want to see some good animes. Yeah, boy. Fucking Edo Manga's sister fucking bullshit. Nah, I'm kidding. <laughs> 